Could you imagine a world wherein the most feared individuals were not criminals, but explorers and warriors from the North? Picture a time when the horizon's glimmer was not the promise of a new day, but the impending arrival of longboats filled with fierce warriors. These were not ordinary men, but a breed of their own, known for their bravery, their skill, and their thirst for adventure. They were the Vikings, a name that still resonates with a sense of awe and fear. Between the 8th and 11th centuries, during what we now refer to as the Viking Age, these Scandinavian seafarers ruled the seas, their influence shaping the course of history. They were not just warriors, but also explorers, traders and skilled navigators. Their reputation was such that their very name stirred fear in the hearts of those who heard it. They were the Vikings, the seafarers from Scandinavia, who left an indelible mark on the world. In the late 8th century, the Viking Age dawned, an era that would change the course of history. The Vikings, renowned for their seafaring prowess, embarked on a series of raids that would send shockwaves through Europe. Among these was the infamous attack on the holy island of Lindisfarne, an event that sent a chilling message to the rest of the world. The Vikings were a force to be reckoned with, but what drove these fierce warriors to embark on such daring ventures? The answer lies in a combination of necessity and ambition. The Vikings' homeland, Scandinavia, was harsh and unforgiving, pushing them to seek wealth and resources elsewhere. Furthermore, the Vikings' unique shipbuilding skills allowed them to navigate the open seas with an ease that was unparalleled at the time. This was the dawn of the Viking Age, a period marked by relentless raids exploration and cultural exchange. The Viking Age had begun and with it came a reign of terror and exploration that would span over three centuries. On the battlefield, the Vikings were a force to be reckoned with. These seafaring warriors from the north were not just raiders and explorers. They were skilled and brutal fighters. Their weapons of choice were as diverse as they were deadly. From the fearsome Dane axe with its long handle and broad blade to the trusty Viking sword, Known for its sharpness and durability, each weapon was a testament to their prowess in battle. But what truly set the Vikings apart was not the weapons they wielded, but the way they fought. Their battle tactics were innovative and effective, often involving a combination of surprise attacks, encirclements, and the infamous shield wall formation. This allowed them to take on larger forces and emerge victorious. The Vikings' warrior culture was deeply ingrained in their society, from a young age, boys were trained in the art of war, learning to handle weapons and fight. Their society revered the warrior, celebrating their victories in songs and sagas that are still remembered today. Central to this warrior culture was the belief in Valhalla, the warrior's paradise. This was a place where those who fell in battle were said to go to feast and fight alongside the gods. This belief fostered a fearless approach to combat, to the Vikings, death in battle was not to be feared, but celebrated as the ultimate honour. It was this mindset that made them such formidable opponents, willing to fight to the bitter end, no matter the odds. But their ferocity was not just limited to the battlefield. The Vikings were known for their ruthlessness in battle, often showing no mercy to their enemies. They would burn villages, take prisoners, and even sacrifice their enemies to their gods. These acts of violence only added to their fearsome reputation, making them one of the most feared cultures in history. Their ferocity in battle was legendary, earning them a reputation as some of the most feared warriors in history. Such was the might of the Vikings, a testament to their strength, courage and indomitable spirit. They were not just warriors, but legends, their deeds forever etched in the annals of history. By the end of the 11th century, the Viking Age was drawing to a close, but the Vikings' influence was far from over. The Viking Age, characterized by seafaring Norsemen exploring, trading, and often raiding, was a defining era in the world's history. Yet, as the Viking Age drew to an end, the impact of these fierce warriors and seafarers continued to reverberate across the globe. Trade routes established by the Vikings, stretching from the chilly Arctic to the warm Mediterranean, laid the groundwork for global commerce. These paths of exchange didn't just circulate goods, they also facilitated the spread of ideas, cultures and technologies. The Vikings were not just raiders and traders, but also explorers. 
they ventured further than any European before them, reaching as far as North America hundreds of years before Columbus. Their exploration spirit has echoed through the ages, inspiring countless voyages of discovery. Their cultural influence was equally significant. The Vikings' Norse mythology has been woven into the fabric of modern storytelling, from epic sagas to films and literature. Characters like Thor, Odin and Loki, gods of the Vikings, are now household names, a testament to the enduring allure of Viking culture. The Vikings also left a lasting imprint on the English language. Words like ransack, berserk and thrift all have Viking origins. They also left their mark on place names, particularly in the British Isles. Towns ending in By or Thorpe, for example, are Viking legacies, revealing the extent of their settlement and influence. In conclusion, the end of the Viking Age did not signify the end of the Viking impact. Their contributions to trade, exploration and culture have shaped the world as we know it. The Vikings' influence extended far beyond their time, leaving a lasting legacy that continues to inspire and fascinate us. Though the Viking Age may have ended, their legacy lives on, a testament to their power, influence and indomitable spirit.